Hi, our experiment today goes around uh, energy saving on pool pump systems. Um, the equipment that we are operating with is uh, a, a standard Gemini swimming pool uh, supplied by Sundance Pools. Uh, 46,000 liters is the capacity and the pool is equipped with a uh, Barracuda cleaner, pool cleaner. Um, at the present moment the pool runs, the pool pump runs for eight hours during the day, four hours in the morning and four hours in the evening. And the pump is in this little chamber here. The pump is a conventional uh, Porpoise 90-16 which is supplied by spec pumps. This is a normal 220 volt single phase 0.75 kilowatt motor and initially our uh, experiment is to see what sort of amperage is going to be drawn by the motor under normal load operating using conventional methods uh, of main, mains power. We've got an ammeter here. The ammeter reading with the pump off is very nearly zero. Uh, we're activating the pump now. As can be noted, the reading has increased, going up to on average 3.3. 3.3 amps. This is the normal energy that's drawn by the motor. We've now installed a single phase variable speed drive. This is a variable speed drive that works off 230 volts providing 230 input uh, on single phase as well as 230 single phase output. Uh, these particular type of drives are fairly rare. This particular drive is fairly low cost and economical. Um, the drive has been set with three different settings, three different speeds, and the pool pump will operate uh, for four hours at a lower speed, around about 35 hertz, as this speed still allows the the pumps, uh, the pool's vacuum cleaner uh, to work, and at a higher speed also allows it to work, but just with more confidence. So we'll run it and see what amperage it draws at the lower speed first and then at the higher speed. There she ramps up. She's going to ramp up all the way to 45 hertz. At 45 hertz, we can see that motor speed is 2,897 RPM, and at this speed, the amperage reading on the amp meter is 2,62 amps, considerably less than when the pump runs at its full speed. We will now lower the speed to the second setting. That's the RPM that the unit is running at now. 2094. Or 35 hertz, and at 35 hertz, the motor is drawing 1.33 amps, 1.32 amps, according to the amp meter. And just to verify. We still have perfect operation of the pool vacuum cleaner. It's functioning 100%. So 
significant savings can be unlocked by this type of technology and we will put up some tables in this video to show what sort of ta uh, savings can be achieved.